guys, so I am back with another great, great credit card that is good for those people that's a student and you're looking to get approved for a credit card and you probably don't have any history at all. Or maybe you already have history, but it's just not much. So you're looking for one of the best credit cards for a student. I definitely have that credit card for you all here. Now, a few days ago, I already talked about another credit card through Capital One because the credit card I'm going to talk to you guys about right now is through Capital One. But with that other credit card, you guys had one and a half percent unlimited cash back. So definitely check out that video. But this one, this credit card here, it has 1% base cash back. So on all your purchases, you're going to get that 1% um, cash back. But check out the other credit cards that I made for students because just because I'm making a lot of credit cards for students, I think it's probably over 10 to 15 credit cards. I don't want you guys to get them all. I want you guys to find the best one for you. Now with this credit card, I really love it because you guys are going to get 3% unlimited cash back yes unlimited cash back and it's going to be on dining entertainment your proper streaming services and grocery stores so for those students that you know you spend a lot of money because you go out to eat a lot then this credit card would be perfect for you because you guys are going to get three percent unlimited cash back um for your dining your entertainment because you have to go out a lot or if you like to go to the grocery store you guys are going to get that three percent unlimited cash back now like i told you guys the other one i was talking to you guys about is the quicksilver that one is with capital one also so if you guys don't spend a lot of money on dining entertainment popular streaming services or the grocery stores maybe you spend your money a lot on gas or any other things maybe you want to look into that quicksilver one because that's one and a half percent unlimited cash back on all your purchases and they have the same exact limited time offer on this credit card now the limited time offer is going to be different um this video is october 2022 so i don't know if you guys are going to see the offer when you guys look but just check it out they have a hundred dollar cash bonus for those people that's new if you're new and it's your first time with capital one you guys can get that cash bonus so definitely get that because a lot of times you get the cash bonus that's going to be more than you guys can um possibly get with spend a lot of money on your credit card to get that cash back that bonus is like right in your hand you don't have to spend um a lot of money to get it so definitely see if you guys can get that bonus now another thing i do love about capital one is that they actually have no annual fee. So for this credit card, the Saving One Rewards for students, this one, you don't have an annual fee at all. So for those people that want to keep this credit card for a while, maybe want to upgrade your credit card in the future, um, this credit card would be perfect for you because you can keep this credit card for years without having to pay to actually keep the credit card. I tell you guys, like right now in the stage I am in my life, I don't need any credit cards with annual fee. I don't do any type of special traveling right now where it's going to warrant for me to want maybe a credit card to have a $300 annual fee I just don't see it right now in my life but you guys definitely look in your life see if the um, sign up bonuses will be worth it plus the cash back and see if that will be worth it if you guys get to the point where you guys can get other credit cards now with this one you guys will have no foreign transaction fee. So if you guys want to travel, you guys definitely have the option of traveling without getting charged any foreign uh, transaction fees. I talked to you guys a few days ago about the um, Chase credit card for students. That would have a foreign transaction fee. Um, I also talked to you guys about Discover. Discover does not have any foreign transaction fees. So if foreign transaction fees is something that you do not want to pay, then definitely um, get this credit card or any ca uh, credit card with Capital Want and then look into discover too because discover they do not have any foreign transaction fees now don't forget you guys want to get that three percent unlimited cash back um when you guys do get that hundred dollar bonus you have to make sure you spend at least a hundred dollars that's you have to spend a hundred dollars on your credit card within the first three months of opening your account if you do not spend that money you're not going to get the bonus i see some people get the credit card and they're like okay i'm just going to buy a bag of chips with it every month and then they miss that bonus make sure you guys spend at least a hundred dollars and if you want to just spend it one time um then definitely spend it one time just spend a hundred dollars get it out the way and if you don't want to use your credit card so much after that then that's an option for you but just make sure you do spend at least a hundred dollars within the first three months of opening your account so you can get that bonus and Capital One, they have something called Credit Wise where you guys can have access to looking at your credit scores. Um, your credit scores will definitely sign up for that. You should see it right in the app too. 
but definitely be checking your credit because you guys could possibly get approved for a higher credit limit and you guys could possibly get approved for another credit card with capital one but first they wanted to see how good you're doing then you can try to see if you can upgrade your account upgrade your credit card to another credit card and any of your rewards that you get on your credit cards with capital one they're not going to expire so don't think oh my gosh i got herp use my rewards or any of these different things a lot of times with capital one when you're doing good on your accounts they can just upgrade your account to a new credit card that have different type of bonuses maybe you thought you wanted this credit card um maybe you wanted this credit card you're like oh three percent on dining but now you realize you're not eating out a lot i mean you're not going out to eat a lot you're not a lot you're not, not doing a lot of um entertainment spending you're not doing a lot of those different things you can try to see if you can upgrade your credit card to a different um credit card but you can redeem your um cash back in different ways you can just redeem it for cash you can use it to cover some of your purchases so if you have a purchase you can use your cash back to cover it that way or you can actually get it back in um, gift cards i like to just um get get it back as a statement credit get it back in cash as a statement credit just pay just pay it on my credit card because i know i'm going to use a credit card anyway just um pay it on just pay off my credit card just give me that bonus that way now i know with discover with my discover credit card whenever i have cash back say if i have like 30 dollars in cash back and if i say i want to pay 600 dollars on my bill they're going to ask me do you want to use your 30 dollars so that you only have to pay 570 dollars and i have the option to say yes or no at that time and um with capital one they can just put that on your account similar to that so definitely check that out now capital one they have so many different things that they can offer you guys like 24-hour travel assistance um you guys are also going to have the capital one shopping capital one travel um instant purchase notifications so whenever your credit card is being used they'll let you know so all these different things would be great for you guys let me know if you guys actually get approved for this credit card don't forget they can pre-qualify you for this credit card without a hard inquiry so they're going to tell you yes or no on whether or not they can give you this credit card without a hard inquiry if you accept it capital one pulled all three credit bureaus so you're going to have a hard inquiry on all three credit bureaus yes i know that's bad right but you're going to have a hard inquiry on all three credit bureaus if for some reason you're not getting approved for this credit card or the other credit cards look into signing up for my exclusive membership it's a dollar trial to get inside of my exclusive membership it's where i teach you guys how to build your credit how to remove those inaccurate and negative accounts from your credit reports i talked to you guys about these same credit cards but it's just without ads you guys can just watch them straight through without the ad so definitely sign up for my exclusive membership if you ever have any questions I hired, I hired a team so they can be able to answer any questions that you guys have just give us a call and we'll be sure to answer those questions for you now YouTube they know what we watch they know what we want to watch and they know what we need to watch so check out these other videos that YouTube think that you may love so definitely check these out and if you find a video that you love and it was very helpful to you make sure you guys always like that video make sure you guys are su subscribed and leave me a comment let me know if you like the video and let me know if you have any questions but I'll see you guys in the next video bye bye